thank, thanks to the council. Uh, I just have a, a very brief uh, comment. I, uh, I recently got back from uh, eight or nine days in China on, uh, on private business. And uh, boy, am I ever glad to be back home. Um, but I wanted to relay a particular incident. There was um, a group that uh, somehow, I'm not quite sure, uh, knew that I was there. This was in the, uh, the town of Quiming, which is about a three-hour flight from Shanghai. And it's a resort town. And uh, the gentleman was the, or is, the chairman of the uh, Chinese Wine and Alcohol Committee. And you have to remember that everything in China is run by the Communist Party, and it's a very different system than what we have here. And they invited me to join them in their monthly meeting concerning wine and alcohol. Um, and, uh, and it was uh, quite an honor, and uh, although I felt a little sheepish because we met in the Senate chamber of the Communist Party, um, <laughs> I felt very uneasy, I have to tell you. And the gentleman who was the chairman um, didn't speak any English, and I don't speak any Chinese, and he spoke through an interpreter. And he said he wanted to thank me and all Americans for the support that we provided to China during World War II when we sent the Flying Tigers over to defend their nation. It was a different time, a different place. But I have to tell you, political ideology aside, um, he put me at ease very, very quickly. And I thought that was... Uh, Pretty nice thing for him to say, and so I'm relaying that to all of you that that thank you comes to all of us uh, from China. So, very interesting. Thank you, Mr. Comichero.